Imagine this, you're all set to edit your project, you click on Adobe Photoshop or Premiere Pro, and bam, a frustrating error pops up. This unlicensed Adobe app has been disabled. Sounds familiar? Well, don't worry. In this video, I'll show you a simple trick to fix this error and get your Adobe app working again without reinstalling or messing with complicated settings. Stay tuned till the end because the solution is easier than you think. So why does this happen? Adobe constantly checks online to verify your software license. If it detects a problem, it disables the app remotely. Now, many people suggest blocking Adobe's internet access through the Windows firewall, but here's the problem. Sometimes it just doesn't work. Why? Adobe uses multiple hidden processes that still connect to the internet even if you block the main app. Some background services bypass firewall rules and keep running secretly. Firewall rules sometimes reset after system updates, making the block ineffective. So if firewall blocking doesn't work, What's the real solution? How do we truly stop Adobe from disabling the app? Well, here's the secret. Instead of blocking the internet completely, we'll take control over it. There's a powerful yet simple trick that allows us to restrict Adobe's access in a way that stops license verification, but keeps the app working perfectly. Prevent Adobe from checking online. Now, here's where the magic happens. Instead of using the firewall, we'll use a different method that actually works. This tool allows us to limit Adobe's internet access in a way that stops license verification without breaking anything else. This method is 100% effective because instead of completely blocking the internet, which Adobe detects, it just slows down or stops specific connections, making it impossible for Adobe to verify the license. So, what's the tool? The tool we'll use is called Net Limiter. It's a powerful internet control tool that allows us to limit, block, or slow down internet access for specific apps without them realizing it. That means Adobe won't be able to verify the license, but everything else will work just fine. How to use Net Limiter. Step one, download and install Net Limiter one. Open your browser and go to www.netlimiter.com. Click on Download, install it, and run the application. Step 2. Apply the Fix one. Open your NetLimiter, and then here you will see the list of all running application. Here you will see Online and Offline option. Now here is the list which are accessing Internet. Now you need to select the app. You want to block Internet connection. If app is not showing here, then first open that app. Now you will see here, click on Out Blocker and then Allow and OK, done. Now, congratulations, you've successfully fixed the error. So now you know why the firewall method fails and how NetLimiter provides a 100% working solution that prevents Adobe from disabling your app again. If this video helped you, don't forget to like and subscribe for more amazing tech solutions. And if you have any questions, Drop them in the comments. I personally reply to everyone. See you in the next video. Happy editing.